Listen, you are really special than your thought. You are greater than your thought. You are beautiful than the enemy is making you to see about yourself. The enemy is the one that always puts it in your heart to condemn yourself, to hate yourself, not to accept yourself, not to love the body you have right now, not to accept yourself the way you have seen yourself. The word of God says, the devil comes not but to keep, to destroy, but I've come to give you that in the last life. God has given us peace, not as the word gave, gave that unto you, says the Lord. But the enemy wants to suck that peace. The enemy wants to make you to be inferior of yourself. He wants to let you see that you are no longer good enough. Maybe you are giving birth to your fat, you have big tummy, but maybe things are changing in your body. But because of that, the enemy wants to use that to put you in a share that you will not be who God has assigned you to be. Child of God. God can never condemn you. God can never body shape you. God can never make you to see less of yourself. So today, I don't know what the enemy has been doing to you in the area of your mind and your body and your thoughts. Today, God wants you to de detoxed it out of your system because you are special than who you thought. The word of God says he has made us kings and queens. That is who God has made us to be. You are special. You are great. You are beautiful. So how do you see yourself today? Change your mindset about it. The word of God says, guide your heart with all diligence, for out of it are the issues of life. The enemy knows that when you see yourself to be both God as assigned you to see, and when you see yourself as God has chosen you to be, you are going to aware and know a lot of things that you have been blind of. But he will not want you to see that. He will want you to see less of yourself and body shape yourself. But today, I don't know what the enemy has been doing to you. Reject it and accept who God has called you. A queen, a king, a peculiar person, a choosing generation, a royal priesthood. Treat your body and love your body. Treat it well as God wants it to be. God bless you. Shalom.